There's no objective way to measure pain, correct? Oh, the last uh, 15 years of my career has been spent on doing that very thing. And where do you think we are in that regard? Much further along than I ever would have predicted. I bet against it. I had some young grad students and others who said that they knew, they, they thought they could do this. I told them how you would do it and I said it won't work. And I'm going to pay you. I'm going to give you money to go scan people and you're going to learn how it doesn't work because failure is a great lesson in life. And they came back and they showed they could do it. I didn't think we could do that because of the hugely individual nature of pain. It's so different from person to person. But it turns out that there are core patterns in the brain that represent that experience of pain. What we've learned through this, it's not one brain region that generates the experience of pain. It is a distributed network. Doing what? <sighs> generating the experience of pain and then generating a, typically a response to that. 